friends welcome back to my channel classes for you today i will explain about different types of number so watch this video till the end it will be very helpful to you friends come back to our video different types of numbers first i will tell you numbers See friends, numbers we use in our day-to-day -day life, right? We use for to see the time. There also we use numbers, right? To count the money also we use numbers. If we want to purchase something, we always say that I want this much quantity, 1 kg or 1 liter like that. So friends, what I want to say that in our day-to-day -day life, these numbers are very useful. And numbers are nothing but the numerals only. If suppose I write 3, okay, this is again a numeral. 3 is your numeral. So, what I want to say that a number is nothing but the arithmetic value. This is arithmetic value which is used to measure any quantity, okay. So, at last I want to say that numbers are very useful in our day to day life. Now next we will see different types of numbers. First type I want to explain about natural numbers which is very useful. See friends many students get confused about uh, between natural numbers, whole numbers, integers. Okay. Likewise we will see first Natural number, natural numbers, okay. So, what are natural numbers? Natural numbers are nothing but the counting numbers only, which is denoted by, these natural numbers is denoted by capital N and the set of natural numbers, it contains the set of numbers that is, it is always start with 1, 2, 3, 4, likewise up to infinity because till the end means infinity. There is no end. Means natural number, you need to remember that it is always starts with 1. Okay. And it continues till the infinity. Next number, we will see about whole numbers. What are that? Whole numbers. Whole numbers, friends, these are the non-negative numbers. Non-negative numbers means it only contain the positive numbers and it is denoted by capital W. And the set of whole numbers, which is always starts with 0, 1, 2 and it is also till the infinity. But the difference is between the natural number and whole number is that you need to remember that uh, natural number is start with 1 and whole number is start with 0. Next, uh, uh, I want to explain about your integers. What is that? Integers. Integers. Integers, friends, again, it contain both positive numbers and means it contain all positive whole numbers and it also include negative natural numbers and it is denoted by capital Z and it contains all that is negative numbers also positive numbers also likewise so integers are those which contain both negative and positive also okay so once we can again we will recall natural numbers which is which is always start with 1, 2, 3 and likewise and whole numbers which is always starts with 0. Integers which is denoted by capital Z and it contains both negative and positive numbers. Next we will see about rational numbers. Okay. Rational numbers. Rational numbers which can be uh, which can be written in the form of ratio form that is small p by q and it is denoted by capital Q. For example, example 
say 5 by 8, okay, 3.62, which can be write as 362 by 100, right? Again, what I written in the form of ratio only, means P by Q form, means numerator and denominator you will find in the rational numbers, okay, and it is denoted by Q. Now next we will see about irrational number. Irrational numbers means which cannot be write in the form of P by Q but it is denoted by P and here I want to tell ex uh, examples of it like say root 2, root 5, these are irrational numbers means here you can't write in the form of ratio. So, these are irrational numbers and it is denoted by P. Next we will see, yes, real numbers. Real numbers are those which contain all the positive, all the positive numbers, fraction form, decimal form, means in these real numbers it include all the numbers. Okay, so these are your real numbers and it is denoted by capital R and example I can say you can include all these numbers. When you include all these numbers, it is your real number. Say suppose 1, uh, 0, 1, root 2, root 5, then again 0 0.62. All these are your real numbers which include all types of numbers, fraction form, decimal form. Okay, so these are your real numbers. Apart from these types of number, I will tell more uh, types are there. I will tell you what are those. So friends, hope you understood about these six types. What are those? Natural number which is denoted by N and it is always start with 1. Whole numbers which is denoted by capital W and it is always start with 0. Integers which is, star, uh, which is denoted by capital Z and it contain both positive and negative numbers. Rational number which is denoted by capital Q and it, it is always written in the form of P by Q means ratio form for example 5 by 8 or you can write this form also again when you will write in the decimal form again you, have, you can write in the ratio form that is fraction form and irrational form Irrational numbers which, uh, which is uh, denoted by capital P and it is written in the form of root like this and real numbers when all these numbers contain real numbers and its example as I written here 0, 1, root 2 like that. So these are the numbers. Next we will see more numbers are there uh, that is your even numbers which is basically very useful. Okay, very useful for uh, your first, second standard in many schools they are teaching about all these numbers and students get confused between all uh, natural, prime number, even number, odd number. So here I will explain what, a, uh, what is that uh, even number that is seventh form I can say. These are uh, another different uh, numbers, even numbers. Okay, even numbers, friends always remember even number which are exactly divisible by 2. We all know that 2 is table 2, 4, 6, 8, okay again 10. When these numbers are there, these are your real numbers. And always uh, remember one thing that is the number form always the numbers which which you suppose I write here 7 like this. These are the numbers which form from 0 to 9. Okay. Always remember these numbers always exist between this two, these numbers only. So even number. So come back to our topic. Even number. So even number which are exactly divisible by 2. That are called even numbers. Next we will see about odd numbers, odd numbers which are not divisible by 2, which are not exactly divisible by 2 that are your odd numbers. Means 
यू कैन से थ्री फाइव सेवन नाइन इलेवन दिज आर ऑल ऑड नंबर वाई बिकॉज फाइव इज नॉट डिविजिबल बाई टू नाइन इज नॉट डिविजिबल बाई टू इलेवन इज ऑल्सो नॉट डिविजिबल बाई टू सो द नंबर्स विच आर नॉट डिविजिबल बाई टू दैट इज योर ऑड नंबर and it can also possess negative numbers also if i write here minus 3 minus 5 again it is odd numbers only so next is your next is prime number prime numbers so prime numbers are what the numbers which has factor the number itself number itself and One having factors. For example, example, say two. Two is having the factor of one and the number itself. Then again three, five, seven, eleven. Then here your thirteen. All these numbers are prime numbers. Why? because it does not have factor more than this the number itself and the one means you can say the number which is having the factor of one and the number itself those are your prime numbers so remember this properly don't get confused between even number odd number and prime numbers even numbers are those which are exactly divisible by 2 odd numbers are those which uh, which are not divisible by 2 and it can possess also negative numbers also prime numbers are those having factor the one and the number itself next we will see about composite number composite number composite number means are those numbers which is having more than two factors for example here i can say 4 6 8 10 why i am writing these numbers because see 4 it is divisible by 1 2 and 4 itself okay so having more than two factors again this 6 1 2 3 and 6 see it is having more, uh, more than two factors so these numbers are your composite numbers composite numbers friends remember again having more than two factors those are composite numbers so in this way you can differentiate between the different types of numbers it which is very useful and many get confused how to differentiate between these two so watch this video it will be very useful and hope so you like it please subscribe this channel thank you